<laughs> Yo, yo, welcome back to Trippy system? Commentaries. Oh, We're here in the aqueducts. We have uh, some weird guy now, Retro Brett. Are we going to help him out? Uh, well, seems like a pretty weird dude, but we're going to have to do it. His name is Covetous Shen. He's requesting our assistance. Considering the huge tasks that we're doing, it's kind of strange how you have to just help out random people, but this is the way in RPGs. And uh, we'll take care of him. It's on the way anyways. Well, he, he seems... He, although he's weird, he seems like a decent guy. He hasn't tried to kill us yet, so my young that's always nice. Like everyone else in this His game. Gavin, so actually. we're, we're going to do him a favor. Yes, we got Leah chilling with us as well. And we really are becoming badass characters here. I know we've said that a lot in this playthrough. That's kind of what Diablo does, though. You're constantly upgrading, so you always feel like you're getting stronger in the game. But uh, I have a ton of good abilities. I'm fully customized. I'm really getting a grasp of all of the abilities that I can use now that we don't have to rely on the game like normally if you don't switch it up like we have the game tells you that you can only have a primary attack with the right trigger you can only have a secondary attack with the A button but if you customize it you can put anything wherever you want and now I have a couple primary attacks the right bumper is a grenade attack that I've been wanting to use and uh, I think I should definitely get used to it this episode. What about you, Retro Brett? Are you getting used to the customization features that we got into? Oh, I'm uh, I'm well versed in the world of Diablo. Mm -hmm. I've been playing it for many years on uh, you and I the, um, the, the PC. But those uh, what is something cool I have to say to us? The witch. They're using start you for their own ends. You choose to be their puppet. Yet, the power of your birthright could make you a god. Striving for godhood, that you are These turrets here while we listen to them. Cool. There's no need to be snide. Soon enough, I'll walk this world again. Hmm. Then I'll show you what a Nephilim can achieve. Nephilim. See, this is one of those classic characters that you're helping out. And he, he's kind of teasing that maybe he could help you out as well once you finish it up. But you really don't trust him at all, even from the start. Well, he just sounds like creepy. He's a creep. Whoa, we got some uh, Lucini Swashers or something around here. Lucini. Not and enough hatred. Beat me up taking advantage of all of my character's moves. I feel like Joker, the Demon Hunter, it looks ridiculous, man. And he's now well-named. I feel like he really is starting to look like a Joker-esque character. Show him off here real quick. Still got to get a new crown. I'm getting a little sick of Leoric's crown. Yeah, it like, kind of looks bland. You've had it for quite a bit. Yeah, and it's one of those things we use in every playthrough. So I'm ready to get something new. Oh, boy. Velron the Hellion. I'm going to keep my distance back here. Maybe throw some grenades into the fray there for you. Wow, these grenades actually do quite a bit of damage on top of, you know, my ranged attacks and you just slashing away over there. Well, we do have three extra people helping us. Yeah. Here we go, another shortcut, even though we just found another portal not too long ago. So this is an interesting section to the desert, you know, before you have the sandy dunes. This is like a bone waste yard right here. Mm -hmm. Remember the Lion King when Simba had to uh, venture <laughs> into the bone yard? Yeah, I guess it kind of does remind, remind you of that, doesn't it? Yes. But we have not Mufasa had to come in and save the day. To change the ancient policy. Here's your favorite little bugs. Prisoners and these bulls make monsters. quick work of them. Die, bugs. To die with nothing. The I think we found place. one of the vaults that has his blood in it. So it looks like Leah has saved behind. I need more hatred. He does not want to that. venture into the boneyard. I do not blame her. Oh, every yard's a boneyard when I'm there. I gotta say, one thing uh, that I'll point out that's really crucial for me right my now is, too is there's, there's so many enemies on screen. This is ridiculous. Um, I'm getting surrounded. You can see I'm Joker here at the top. If you have one guy in front of you, or really multiple guys, you can fall through them and it'll put them in a daze right there. That's really crucial for me to escape with the quickness. My character does not have the shielding that the Barbarian does. 
I really do have to All keep right. my distance. Let's go into uh, this one vault that has blood in it. It's pulsating with a yellow circle. Okay, so we're heading into the vault of the, the assassin. assassin. Familiar place. Yeah, like Retro said, this is pretty much what this uh, this episode's gonna entail. We're gonna have to go into temples that look just like this and recover items for Zoltan Cool. Apparently, we're bringing him back to life or something like that. We have to. Not to, enough to get the Black Soul Stone. The Soul Stone sounds familiar, wasn't it? Involved in the other Diablos? Well, Soul Stones were about the Black Soul Stone. Really? So they're, this is a first time kind of thing? The yes. Black Soul Stone? Mm -hmm. Ooh, there's a trigger. Oh, I'll help you out. In fact, I'll bolt through him to make him not be able to go anywhere. Oh, maybe it doesn't work on the treasure problem. Get away from me. I need more discipline. Take out the treasure goblin. I'm gonna take out this bastard. Oh, treasure! There's some gold over here as well. Oh, two gold. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go this way. Yeah, you lead the way, man. This is gonna be a crazy maze right here. Get some hearts. I have some uh, pretty good active. Uh, abilities going as well. Um, one in particular, when I pick up those globes, it does give me some extra hatred and health. So, uh, any uh, updates on your Barbarian Vader? How's he been doing lately? Yeah, I don't think he's... I've really upgraded him that much in time lately. He's so powerful, he doesn't need much upgrade. Yeah, I hear you there. Uh, I was dual wielding in the last episode. I switched it up. I actually bought some items from a local merchant. Now I'm using a quiver and a and a bow and arrow. Seems to be working out just fine, to be honest with you. Uh-oh. Getting surrounded. Damn, there's so many people over here. I don't know if it's just the new uh, health meters that we have on top of everybody, but I know these are small skeletons in this area. Man, you are going ballistic. What do you think about the, the health meters above everybody? Is that helping you out at all? Oh yeah, it's, it's definitely worthwhile. That way, like I said in a couple episodes that ago, we don't have to look down at our health to find out. That way we don't have to take our eyes off the screen. Yeah, the green health meter above us. Of course, the red health meter above all the enemies. I'm using these turrets, Retro Bright, man. They got homing ability. That's pretty... I see why you're saying it's so helpful. Doesn't matter where you put them, they're gonna knock into something. They're gonna, they're gonna, ooh, brutal massacre. 51 kills. Oh, gotta take these things out. What is this? Another? Uh, Looks like a, a rainbow, rainbow goblin. goblin. Damn. So, is this even better than a treasure goblin? Um, I don't know what the difference is, really. Well, I think this is part of a new update, or at least the newest update. I need more hate to do that. that. Whimsy Dale, let's head to Whimsy Dale. What the hell is going on, Retro Brett? This is definitely not the cow level. Um. Okay. Uh. The map on the Ooh. bottom certainly looks different. What the hell's going on here? We're getting attacked by flowers and cuddly bears. Whimsy Dale. Uh, I don't know how long you want to spend here, there, RJ. What is it? I'm confused. Looks like a Care Bear or something. Care Bear land. It seems a little bit out of place in Diablo. Like, uh, why are we here? <laughs> yeah. The cow level was cool. What the hell? Unicorns? What is going on? Holy shit. There's a lot of flowers. Oh my god. The ancients smile on me. Oh my goodness. Ah, uh, uh, the Care Bears? And a I just ate a cupcake, so... Oh, I see a cupcake. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna get this pot of gold. So what's going on? Do you have any idea why we're here? Uh, well, we went through a portal. So, is this something that randomly happens? Yes. Become more Dale. 
I don't know, we're leveling up like a motherfucker, though. Really? Yeah. Last time I knew, I was halfway to 30, or halfway between 35 and 36. And now I'm at 36. <laughs> Apparently the uh, Care Bears give you a lot of experience then, right? Yeah, I guess it's hard to kill a Care Bear. What? This is pretty sick. Uh, the graphics are dope. Set up some turrets around here. The pot of gold has a heart. My pot of gold. Isn't that nice? You'd think that we would maybe find some legendary weapons in here. Look at this guy, he's just sitting there. I'll fuck you up, My Pink Bear. Too low. Look at it. There's its bloody skeleton. Amazing. So you brought up the cow level. That was a secret level from Diablo 2. And I guess this is just kind of another take on that. You know? Ooh. Looks like we got a pinata there. Ooh. Okay. Do you know how we get out of Whimsy Dale? We're trying to re uh, revive Zoltan Cool. And well, we how we get out is a go back through book. the portal that we just came through. Okay. So uh, this is basically a, a secret area in Diablo Three, I guess we can say. Presence. Oh my! How did Lord. they know? Uh, damn it! They didn't give us anything. Die, unicorn! slaughter all of the unicorns myself. Well, I'm going to click on a heck cloud. What do they do? They do it? Oh, they just give you some gold? Sometimes. This I is, guess they uh, just smile at you. This is definitely trippy. Um, I don't know if this is what I would have went with for a sequel to the cow level. Whimsy Dale. And I know there's another version of this as well. There's Whimsy Dale plus something else. Uh, you have to get there a different way. I'm sure it's kind of like this to where you probably get plenty of experience for killing all this cute stuff. You know what attack I kind of missed was that Storm of Arrows. I'm going to have to re-equip that one for the next episode. That was always nice to uh, attack everything on screen with a simple press of a button. Wasting away in Whimsy Dale. So, do you think we we've actually gotten any items worth anything at this point? We've got um, some yellow stuff. I'm definitely tempted to check to Not see if I have hatred. any new legendaries nah. or no. You would know if you had a legendary. Seems so rare in this game. Is it that rare in Diablo 2 as well? I don't remember actually. I mean, we've gone through maybe like an act and a half now, possibly a little bit more. And still don't have too many uh, legendaries to our name. Well, you don't, but I do. Oh, look at that! I can bring that down. Oh boy, pink rainbow unicorn of death! Oh, they have ice crystals. Wow, these unicorns! Oh, they froze me. They're being slaughtered. They're gonna be turned into glue. Off to the glue factory with you. Ooh, a diamond. There we go. There's something helpful. I need more hatred to do that. Need more hatred. It's hard to have hatred here. Oh, boy. Super awesome sparkle cake. Are you kidding me? Super awesome sparkle cake. What the hell is going on? I just lit him on fire, so. <laughs> Very nice. Well done. That'll teach you for being all pink and girly. Gonna grenade it for the win. See that? The grenade blew it up into two chunks, Retro. Wow. Sliced him right in half. So I'm getting a notion here that this place is absolutely massive. Eh, we're almost, we almost explored it all. Oh, there's a Care Bear and a flower. I shall kill the flower. And the Care Bear. You make sure work of the Care Bear. Yeah, I wish they would have done something a little bit better than this. I mean, I know it's a funny joke, especially considering most people who play Diablo are into, uh, Ooh, mushrooms. you know, killing and, and demonic stuff, considering the game is called Diablo. And this Ooh, is about as, it's about as opposite as it gets. Maybe they just want to give you an excuse to behead unicorns, unicorns and whatnot. 
Care Bears and Rainbow Bright and all that shit. <laughs> Where's the Powerpuff Girls? We need to sort of take them out as well. Oh, it looks like there's baseballs and soccer balls and footballs out on the edges of the map. At least they have something mainly. Yeah, yeah. Balls, footballs. I mean, I will admit, I do like a cupcake. Chocolate cupcake. Happy clouds. Or a uh, pinata. Yeah, we're gonna have to head out of here, and it... Inventory is limited. Oh, jeez. Picked up so many items, we can't even get more. Is that you or me? I think it's me. Alright, well, uh... You think there's anything else in here worth getting? Should we continue to slaughter all of these guys? I guess, man, you're right. Our experience is climbing pretty good by going through here. You're actually ahead of me, though. Because hmm. some item you picked up has a ton of experience gain. Oh, really? And remember, for several episodes, I was slightly ahead of you. Yeah, I do remember that. Hmm. Well, this place is uh, certainly colorful. We'll go ahead and finish it off. Oh man, they took me out up there. <laughs> oh, they did? I didn't even notice, man. I was signing out, and then next thing you know, I disappeared. And uh, we'll meet you guys when we escape this hell. Well, we are almost here at the end. It looks like there's one more uh, super boss more in here, Retro Bread. Looks like uh, a flower boss. And I was hoping that we'd get something really cool to finish it off. You know, we've had a couple of giant unicorns. You know, I was hoping maybe a, a giant bear, but no, they end it with Hex, Phil Pit. The flower. The flower, yes. Well, it's been fun here in Whimsydale. A little bit strange, certainly very trippy. Let's head back to the Vault of the Assassin. Uh, let's go this way. So, so I guess it's the rainbow trolls that make the entrances to Whimsydale? I was wondering, because I've played this game quite a bit. You know, I have multiple characters started up here on our Xbox One version of the game. Of course, Retro Bread has played a lot of the PC version. Um, I actually haven't beaten the game yet. I have a wizard character who's right at the very end, and I, I don't want to beat it because I want to beat it for the first time on this playthrough. But that said, I've never seen the rainbow troll until now. And, uh, pretty cool. Awesome how it takes you to Whimsydale. I think we both agree that we wish it was something a little bit cooler for the Easter egg. But wow. we'll take it. It is quite different than the regular game, though. That's, that's for sure. Yeah, that it is. Man, a lot of guys here, man. They are starting to load up the screen with enemies. Doesn't help that you also have multiplied yourself. Me? Yes. Well, the people that I summon help us fight, so... Yes. It still uh, add to the amount of action that's on the screen. But you can't kill them. You can't hurt them. That's yeah, that's certainly good. Oh man, can you imagine if there was friendly fire in this game? We'd be destroying each other left and right by accident. Uh, I think I that's the dead end. Power. Oh, nice. You have uh, leveled up. Level 37. We made a lot of progress in this episode. So have you. You leveled up before me. 37. Damn, guys. I guess it was a good idea to head to Whimsydale. We'll catch you in the next episode. We're going to... Uh, let's kill these I mean, are we, are we definitely going to bring Sultan Cool back to life? I feel like it could be a trap, Retro Bright. Um, This is Diablo. What can happen? The story it's, demands it, right? That's the worst that can happen. All right, this is where we need to be. One of these three... Oh, I guess it's this one. Because there's a circle right there. Hey, what do we have here? Oh, the blood of Zoltan Cool. We and did it. Found Kool's archives. They were wow. Oh shit! Empty. Shouldn't have done that. At first. Oh boy, we have a boss battle, guys. Everywhere. We'll see if we can take him on in the next episode. Stay trippy. Next.